Hi students, welcome to Samachir Study YouTube channel. In this video, textbook exercises will be solved from Standard 8 Science Unit 1 Measurement. Students, textbook exercises la already 1 to 4 topics paathachi. Innaki assertion and reason type questions on. Answer very briefly yon. Detail la discuss panala. So first question. Consider the statements given below and choose the correct option. This is the assertion and reason type questions. This is the four different options. In the options, we will read the question over question. That is the assertion true or reason true. Now, check the second question. This is the reason and the assertion is correct explanation. Check the students. So, direct the question. The SI system of units is the suitable systems for measurements. This is the assertion. This is true statements. We have to use the SI system of units for measurements. So, this is true. Check it out. The SI unit of temperature is Kelvin. This is true statements. First, we have to check the two true ones. The two true ones. Check it out. In the reason, in the first question, assertion statement is correct. If you look at the SI unit of temperature Kelvin, in the first question, statement is not the same explanation. Okay, this is a separate statement. If you are true, this is not the assertion. So, if we tell what answer is, we have already told you that in four options, the second option is, both assertion and reason are true, but reason is not the correct explanation of assertion. This is our answer. Arko. So, in the first question, answer B. Okay. Second, electric current, amount of substance, luminous intensity or the fundamental physical quantities. Yes, fundamental physical quantities like the Lame were. Reason, they are independent of each other. Ama. நம்ம் physical quantities எடுக்கும் போது fundamental quantitiesல ஒவ்வன்னும் இன்னும்னுக்கு independent அதை அடுப்பா independent நான் என்னது ஒரு value இன்னோரு value வா depend பண்ணியது அது சார்ந்து இருக்காது எல்லாமே தனித்தனியா இருக்கிறதாதா நம்ம independentன்னு சொல்லுவாம் அப்போம் assertionும் true reasonும் true அதே டைம்ல இந்த reason வந்து assertionே explainும் பண்ணது அப்போ both are true and reason is the correct explanation of assertion. So, option A is the right answer. Next question. Radian is the unit of solid angle. Students, solid angle, plane angle in the two types of angles. This is the solid angle unit of the steradian. The assertion is false. If the assertion is false, the reason for the assertion is to explain the assertion. If the assertion is wrong, the reason is wrong. If you have a statement of right statements, if you have a statement of right statements, if you have a statement of right statements, but if the assertion is false, then the reason for the assertion is to explain the assertion. Okay, that's why you choose assertion and reason or false option D. Next, answer very briefly. This is all one word question students. If you have a question, you can answer one word. First question, how many base quantities are included in SI system? So, first page is, SI system is the base quantity, 7 quantities. You can note the answer as 7. 7 base quantities are included in SI system. Add the question is, Give the name of instrument used for the measurement of temperature. Temperature is the use of measure? Thermometer. So, the answer is thermometer. Next question, What is the SI unit of luminous intensity? Luminous intensity is one of the base physical quantity. This is the unit candela. C-A-N-D-E-L-A. This is the answer. Next question. What type of oscillations are used in atomic clocks? Atomic clocks are very specific to use the oscillation. Vibration students. Periodic vibrations. Okay. So, Oscillations used in atomic clocks in the catalog, you will answer periodic vibrations. Next question, 
Mention the types of clocks based on their display. Display based on two types of clocks. Irukudhu. Analog and digital. So, analog digital is the answer. How many hours are there in a minute? So, this is the simple solve. One minute is 0.0167 hours. This is the calculate. Pannanunna? 1 hour 60 minutes அது எல்லாருக்குமே தெரியும் so நம்ம calculate பண்ண வேண்டியது 1 minute அதனால நீங்க எப்படி எழுதணும்னா 60 minutes 1 hour 60 minutes equal to 1 hour therefore 1 minute equal to 1 divided by 60 1 divided by 60 calculate பண்ணீங்கனா answer எப்படி இருக்கும்னா 0.01666 னு போயிட்டு இருக்கும் so, this is the approximate panni eladunona epdi eluduvom 0.0167 so this is the answer okay students hope you understand all these questions if you like this video please subscribe and share it to your friends thank you so much for watching